On today's episode, we're gonna talk about local traffic to your website, digital coupons, and influencer marketing. Hello and welcome to episode 80 of Tip for Tip, where you ask your marketing question in exchange for a tip in your industry. My name is Iron Man. And my name is Spider-Man. And today we have Abby Alter from Plano Moms. My question today for Bit Branding is how do I drive more local traffic to my website and how do I optimize through SEO and find the best keywords? All right, Abby, those are those. All right, Abby, so those are great questions. We're going to tackle that in two parts. Christian is going to answer your question about traffic, and I will answer your question about keywords. Yeah, so local traffic to your website, some of the best things you can do is video. Um, I know right now you're not currently doing a lot of video, um, but we do know that you're doing these what's going on this weekend in Plano. Uh, it would be great to do sort of transform that blog post into a just pictures and, and text uh, videos uh, with some cool animations. Uh, and those would be great and will drive a lot of traffic to your website. And also, I know you do offers, uh, but maybe mold that into more digital coupons um, and do more partnerships with local uh, stores and local business owners. And also pair that with a sort of tag or something that says Plano Moms uh, approved or Plano Moms recommended or Plano Moms certified. Uh, so they can put that in their physical stores. Uh, so that in part will take you back to your website and your offers. Um, and all that. Very good stuff there. And I would suggest the videos upload those on YouTube as well because you're going to get a really high completion rate. Um, so for the keywords, it's kind of, it's easy um, or it's simple but not easy necessarily. Uh, one thing you can do is get a keyword research tool. Um, you can just Google that. We'll also put some below. Uh, no affiliate with them. Um, some of them are free. You can also look at BuzzSumo and kind of see what are popular terms for your industry. Um, but when you get that keyword rank tool, the two things that you want to look at are the competitiveness and then how many key or how many searches of that per month. So it does you no good if they only have five searches per month and it has high competition. Um, but if you have something that has like 90 or 100 searches per month and you can uh, take that first page listing, that's what you would want to use. So um, every business is going to be specific and it's going to require a little bit of research. I would try to say, try to tackle five to 10 of those um, and do some research on those and then create content around them. Um, and that will help you with your keyword rankings and then boost up your total traffic for your website as well. Mm -hmm. All right, let's hear your tip for us. So my tip for your audience today is to consider using influencer marketing. One way of using influencer marketing is if you are a hairstylist, for example, you would find a local influencer on Facebook or Instagram, reach out to them, invite them to your salon, give them some treatments, and work out with them how they can spread the word amongst their audience. That's a great tip and influencer marketing is something that a lot of businesses around here should be doing, especially local businesses um, and especially these micro influencers um, because a lot of people think that influencers are these people who have millions and millions of followers, but that's not necessarily true. Uh, you can find some local influencers that maybe have five, 10,000 followers. Uh, kind of like you. So that's, that's a great mm -hmm. plug for Abby and Plano Moms. Um, also, what I was gonna say completely left me, but influencer marketing is very inexpensive too. It's very, very um, a high ROI for the amount of money that you have to put it put into that. All right, so the question of the day today is, what are you gonna be for Halloween? All right, so Abby, we wanna thank you for coming on the show. Um, we're gonna put all the links for information so people can find out more about you. Uh, we also have a special shout out with Jen from Simply Pretend for all the cool equipment um, and stuff that we have here. We also had a, a dog bone or a caveman bone. A lot we had of options. We had options. We had options, yes. So if you um, are looking for something for Halloween, definitely give Jen um, a call or an email. Uh, we're going to put her information in this episode as well. And at the end of this, if you are a business owner with like free advertising for your business, all you have to do is go to bitbraining.co forward slash tip for tip, fill out the form, and we will get you on the show. Bye.